At the Brøndby Stadium on Saturday night, Denmark faced their neighbours, Norway, in the second of two all-Scandinavian friendlies before Euro 2024. Midweek, Kasper Hulman's team defeated Sweden 2-1 thanks to a comeback hero, while their opponents defeated Kosovo 3-0 thanks in part to a frequent suspect. In Wednesday's match between Denmark and Sweden in Copenhagen, the Premier League players were genuinely showing off their skills. Pierre-Emil Hoshbio broke the deadlock in just two minutes, and Alexander Asak responded quickly after. But over three years after his Euro 2020 cardiac collapse stunned the sport, Christian Eriksen emerged with an emotional winner for his country in the 86th minute, helping them to maintain their unbeaten record for the year. The Manchester United player was largely responsible for this. Having also recorded a 2-0 victory over the Faroe Islands and a 0-0 draw with Switzerland in their 2024 campaign, Denmark has undoubtedly learned from the shocking 2-0 defeat to Northern Ireland in their final Euro 2024 qualifying match. Hulman's team now has one more chance to win over the manager before Group C matches against England, Serbia and Slovenia take precedence. However, the Danish manager would have already submitted his final squad selection to UEFA before to the start of the match on Saturday. Although a sack's goal ended Denmark's amazing run of 11 straight home-friendly clean sheets, the Scandinavian team has now gone 15 straight exhibition games without losing at home, and they haven't lost a game like that without scoring any goals since 2012. Erling Haaland, a Manchester-based player, stole the show for Norway at Ullevar Stadion, where he single-handedly crushed Kosovo, while Eriksen reveled in his dramatic last gasp victory for Denmark in midweek. With 75 minutes remaining, the Manchester City star completed another match-winning performance with his 22nd career hat-trick, a feat that none of Harry Kane, Kylian Mbappe, or Sergio Aguero can match, as Norway ended a three-game losing streak across all competitions. But with just 11 points from their qualification round, Haaland and company will not be challenging Denmark for European glory. Instead, all of the preparations are now focused on another spell in League B of the Nations League with Kazakhstan, Austria, and Slovenia. Eriksson made history by scoring the game-winning goal against Sweden. With just one more cap to play, he will tie Peter Schmeichel for second place all-time with 130 goals for the national team.